And today, President Trump announced that the Department of Education will not be enforcing standardized testing requirements, and Virginia leaders discussed the changes this afternoon. 10 News reporter uh, Taj Simmons joins us live tonight in Roanoke with the very latest. Taj, how does this affect our students here in the Commonwealth? John, today's Department of Education meeting happened less than an hour after the federal government came down with their announcement, so they couldn't really go into depth about what that means for us here in Roanoke. However, what it likely means is that the Department of Education will move to cancel standards of learning tests, or as we commonly call them, SOLs. Board President Daniel Gecker said during today's call that the department will apply for a federal waiver from SOLs. Superintendent of Public Instruction James Lane added the department already had plans to work with state and federal governments to delay or cancel SOLs even before the federal announcement came down. This briefing is intended to prepare for the possibility that there would be no SOLs this year and make sure the board is aware of all the requirements that will need to be get completed with the feds and then uh, and then obviously with the governor and the legislature. Additionally, Lane does have the authority to shorten school years. The Department of Education is currently developing a standard application so each district can quickly ask the superintendent. Additionally, the department has put together an answer sheet filled with the questions they've been getting most about their COVID-19 response. You can find out what they said on our website, WSLS.com. For now, reporting live in Roanoke, Taj Simmons. 10 News, working for you.